In this video, we're going to show you how to install the transmission mount on your Ford Mustang, located at the tail side of your transmission. Now we're going to go ahead and remove a series of bolts on the transmission cross member. There's two on either side and then two in the middle here. We're going to use our transmission jack here or our pole jack. Now, if you're using a regular floor jack, go ahead and use that on the back side. You could use a block of wood between the transmission and your jack if you'd like to. Now, we're not going to lift the transmission. It's literally, we're going to wiggle this around until it makes contact. And that's it. It's in place. Just want to support the transmission while we remove these bolts. We're going to remove our two center bolts here. These are 16 millimeter. Go ahead and set those bolts aside. Now, before we remove our four transmission bolts to the chassis itself, we can see that the hole is a little bit slotted here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and use a crayon, and I'm going to mark right on the edge here where this is going to go, and I'm going to do it on the other side as well. That way there, when I install this here, we can make sure that we're getting this pretty much spot on. We want to make sure that this transmission tail section stays lined up when we install the new part. Using a 13 millimeter socket, let's loosen and remove our four bolts. bracket. Now on installing the new bracket you want to make sure that these tabs are on the passenger side. I'm going to raise this up in a position and we're just going to start our bolts by hand. And make sure that these are not cross threading when you're installing them. Now when we're installing the newer transmission mount you can tell that our old transmission mount was worn because we have to jack up the tail end of the transmission a little bit. So we're gonna go ahead and raise this up until that mount sits flush on that chassis and install the two bolts on the other side. Now I wanna go ahead and line this up. Make sure that is centers the best possible. And then let's go ahead and install our two center transmission bolts here. These two center bolts in most cases will center this mount for you. But the purpose of lining this up here is in case the jack or whatever had moved left or right, the mount will still line up with the transmission, but it could be off center on the body here. And if you don't have this lined up properly, you could introduce a drive line vibration or something to that later on. So make sure that, that lines up with your crayon marks that we previously did. Let's go ahead and just snug these down. We don't want to make them super tight, but we're going to snug them in place. Double check, make sure it's lining up with your crayon mark. With those four snug, let's go ahead and snug down the two bolts here. We're gonna torque our four outer bolts to 41 foot-pounds. Let's torque our two main bolts here to 59 foot-pounds. We 
Once you have those torqued, go ahead and remove the jack from the mount. You can go ahead and lower the vehicle and you're all set. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.